On the foreign scene, less than 48 hours after an unexplained Johannesburg blast, police and emergency teams are still coming through the scene. On Thursday, the public was being urged to stay away from the site of the incident so as not to hamper the investigation. One man died and at least 48 people were injured after an explosion ripped open roads and flipped vehicles in the heart of South Africa's biggest city, authorities and emergency services said on Thursday. The course of the blast at the Wednesday evening rush hour in downtown Johannesburg remained unclear. An investigation is underway as city authorities brought in specialists to determine what other underground pipes or cables there were in the area and if there was a threat of another explosion or gas leak. It's not about looting. It's about um, keeping this scene sterile so that people, they mustn't interfere here. And who knows? Uh, should we have a secondary explosion, then we may lose life. So we are trying to can keep people out of this area and to allow the experts um, uh, who will be coming to work here so that they can work and rehabilitate the place or declare the area to be safe before we can allow people to can roam around here.